Honda and today I'm going to talk to you guys about my glamorous must-haves for the month of February and if I sound a little weird it's because I'm sick I've been sick for the past couple of days and it sucks and I'm trying to soothe my throat so I'm not coughing throughout this whole video with this tea but it's not my favorite it's called the green tea lemon and ginseng or something like that and it's just whatever it's the best I found so far but a couple of days ago I actually um, had tea at my friend's house and she had like the most amazing tea it was called like zinger or something like that and it was amazing it was really 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 good I'm actually craving that tea so I'm gonna text her to find out what it was but if you guys know of any teas that are really good and like sweet because I love sweet and I love like lemon or anything like that please leave it in a comment down below because I really really want to find a tea that I love because I've been loving to drink the tea but but um, the flavors, I haven't really found something that I really liked except for that other one. So, and also let me know how you make it. Like if you put um, sugar or if you put like honey, because I've been putting honey in mine, or how you prepare it. I don't know, there's different ways of preparing tea. So let me know because I really, really want to find one that I love. First, I want to talk about two beauty products that I have on my lips right now. The first one is this Revlon Color Burst Matte Stain, and it is in the shade Elusive. It's a really pretty, like, rose pinky color, and I swatched it on my hand, and I don't know how it got on my sweater, but it's such a cute sweater, and it's making me sad, but whatever, I'll just take it off later. But this is what it looks like, and it swatches very smoothly. I keep this in my purse, and then I just put it on, and I love how I can put it on without a mirror. It's very low maintenance, and I think that's why I love it so much. And this color can go well with like any eyeshadow or anything like that. It's very neutral and it's super pretty. And on top of that, I have Wet n Wild's High Shane Lip Balm Stain. Not lip balm, sorry. Is it a lip balm or a lip stain? It's not a lip balm. <laughs> it's a lip stain. And I love how glossy it is. And it actually stays on my lips for like 8 hours of course, without reapplying it or anything like that. As you guys could already see, I was sipping on my tea and it's still on my lips and it's still really shiny. And I just love it so much. And this one is in the shade Legendary Face. And I do have a video of all 10 shades on my lips. So if you guys want to check that out, I'll have that in a link down below. Next for beauty favorites is this concealer palette by M Cosmetics from Michelle Phan. And I love the packaging. I love how durable it is. It's just so pretty. I love seeing it on top of my vanity. And I also love the um, how it has like magnets right here so that it doesn't, it's not like difficult trying to open it. So it has a huge mirror as you guys can see. And then it has different shades on the palette. And that is because they are used for different things. For example, this one is the main color and it's just a tiny bit uh, lighter. I am, I think I grabbed the one that's in medium. There's three different ones I think and this one is in medium. And I put this underneath my eyes and I love applying it with a sponge applicator. It just looks flawless. So if I want something a little bit lighter, I go to this shade. This is a little bit darker. That's a highlight. This is to correct um, redness in your face, and this is to correct dark circles underneath your eyes. So they all have a different purpose and a reason why um, they are on your palette. So absolutely love it. It was definitely worth, I think it's like $28 or $30 that I spent on this. Definitely worth every single penny because it gives you a large variety and something that other like, I've never seen a palette like this before, so absolutely love that. So for eyeshadow, I've been using this little trio that actually came in my Ipsy bag. It's a travel size or sample size, whatever you guys want to call it, because this is actually um, the sample size of, like, a larger palette, but I love this one. It's from Pop Beauty, and like I said, it came in my Ipsy bag, and it has, like, these really pretty metallic -y colors, and these three are just perfect for one eyeshadow look, and you don't have to reach out and grab another palette. They're very pigmented, pigmented, and they sell really well on your eyes, and I just love it so much. It's also on top of my vanity, so I can reach for this and I'm actually wearing it on my eyes right now. So another beauty product that I've been loving are these two blushes and the first one is from Unwild. It's called Pearlescent Pink and I've heard so many people rave about this and I see why. It's because it goes with any, any makeup. Usually I have to match like my lip color to my blush or my blush to my eyeshadow, whatever, and it can be quite difficult sometimes because you don't want to look like you have too many different colors on your face. You want it to kind of like 
even out and look more like natural I guess you could say and this one is a perfect shade for that I can wear it with just about any eye color and I just love it so much so this one is in pearlescent pink and another one that I've been loving is this one from Benefit Cosmetics it is in the shade Hervana and I just love it so much as you guys can see it has several different shades and what I like to do is I like to swirl it and it gives you like a purplish kind of like um color to your face and it's very soft and really 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 pretty so absolutely love this one and I didn't think that it would show up on my skin but it does because I'm a little bit darker but it looks so pretty love this one as well so now let's talk about my fashion favorites and it has been such a huge challenge this month because of the snow and the weather and like the salt on the ground it's deteriorating my shoes and it sucks so first let's talk about what's been keeping me warm and they are super cute they are these two beanies from dress link and I just love like the poof and the knitting it's so warm and it looks super cute on your head I've gotten so many compliments on these and they're only two dollars each I believe on dresslink.com so check those out if you guys want something that's like really warm but cute at the same time so another thing that's been keeping me warm are these leggings and they are from shoplately.com I love the lace they're super cute and I also love like the button details that it has they're super adorable and they're extremely warm and I've washed these quite a few times they haven't stretched out or shrunk or anything like that they're like really really good quality and material I'll have the seller of the um of the of these down below so you guys can find them on shoplately.com so next let's talk about shoes now it's been quite a challenge because I've already ruined a couple pairs of shoes because of the salt. They just completely like fell apart and it sucks. But these two shoes have actually um, kept up with the weather and they're super cute. So to dress up, I wanted something with a heel, something that was like a neutral color and I could wear out. And that was very difficult, but I found these from Just Fab. They have like a rubber sole so you're not slipping on the ice or anything like that. They have like a very um, simple style to them so I can wear them with pretty much anything. I love the chunky heels. So I'm not falling on the ground anywhere and it also has like a really cute tassel love these booties so so much and they're high enough where like the snow's not going to get into my feet so these have been my favorite absolutely love them they've been a staple for the past month since my work requires business attire I've I wear flats just because I don't want to fall or anything like that and I've already ruined two pairs of shoes because of the salt and these have been the only ones that have been able to keep up with the weather and they're the Tory Burch Riva flats absolutely love them one of the best investments I've ever made because even though they are very pricey they are very durable and they're comfortable they have like the shape of my feet obviously because leather are just you know, molds the, the shape of your feet and they're very comfortable. Absolutely love these and they've been troopers. They've been lasting through this whole season. So love them very much. And now let's move on to my absolute favorite, which is, of course, purses. I love purses. I switch purses like three or four times a week, I know. And I also switch my wallet. Um, but the one that I always go back to is this one. And it is from my spring collection. Absolutely love this purse. I'm obsessed. And I love this little fur ball that it has. It's super cute. My friend Liz from um, from a purple chair that's her blog and Ms. Liz Hart on Instagram it's the same person but she has different usernames um, she actually has these on all, all of her purses and I absolutely love how it looks it looks super cute and she's the one who got me like to really put like accessorize my purse on top of it being an accessory so um, check her out she has her own channel she just started too and she's amazing and inside it has a lot of room so like I said this is for my spring collection you guys have probably seen it a lot on my Instagram and that is just because I love the color and it's so big and spacious and inside I have a lot of junk as you guys could already see um, and then I also have oh let me show you how crazy this month has been for me so this is my planner it has a picture from when I went to California to the Generation Beauty event in June last year and that's Rhonda Ashley and myself I was I already had my hair uh, dyed black and we were at the benefit booth that's where we had the little cute little benefit stuff and these are like sponsors that I have or just you know just some stuff that makes me happy and then if you guys look at February this is what my month looked like it looks crazy and this month is already filling up it's only like the couple it's only what what's today's date it's only the 3rd of March and it's already filling up again so 
a little crazy planning everything together so um, I've been loving this purse so much and on top of that I've been loving my wallet now I usually switch wallets along with my purse but not this month I've just like obsessed with this wallet it's super cute and I love the tassel that it has it was a present from Christmas from my market team and it has like the Tory Burch logo on top and it's very very spacious right there as you guys can tell absolutely love this it also comes with like a little um wrist strap so you can wear it as a wristlet and has enough space for your phone but I like to put this in my purse so is that everything that I have for this month yes that is everything so let me know what you guys recommend for a tea that's really good I love sweet stuff and let me know if you guys put like honey or sugar or how you guys prepare tea because I'm having kind of a hard time and I love tea it's just that um I don't like certain flavors but I like the one my friend showed me so I'll have that so yeah, that is all, and I will talk to you guys next time. Muchos besos. Mwah.